What is going on everybody? My name is Lorenzo and this is Crypto with Lorenzo and as you've seen from the title we are going to go and talk about Zilliqa and what are the possibility for the future of this token and it is looking very very bright and I will go and show you everything right now. So if you are a supporter of Zilliqa leave a like, subscribe, comment and with that said we jump straight onto the laptop without wasting any more time and we are here on Twitter. Now the thing that I want to go and talk to you about, that I want to go and show you, I will go and show it to you right now. And it is this gameplay that they have just released on their YouTube channel, which is something really, really cool. Now, we talked about the Zilliqa Shooter game. Now, this is the alpha version multiplayer footage, and this is a low poly shooter in game footage for the first time we see it. Now, look at this. So. We are talking about a Call of Duty Modern Warfare lookalike game, which is very, very sick. If you want to go and look at the trailer for yourself, you can also go and find it on YouTube or on their Twitter page, but it looks very, very good. Remember that this is a blockchain game, so it's not a PS5 game, it's not a PS4 game, it is not a console game, it is a blockchain game, which is something really, really good. It does look very animated, now it is not yet released, they are still work in progress so it will just keep on getting better and better from what it is right now but it looks like something is really really going to pop off in my opinion for the future with this game. Why do I mean this? Well, this is going, whether you are a Zilliqa supporter, whether you are not a Zilliqa supporter, this will take a lot of people to go and play the game. Now. Depending on Zelika, it's up to them to go and make it even better and make it in a way that if somebody is not involved into the Zelika ecosystem, they are able to go and either purchase the token or have in-game currency, for example, buy a new skin for the weapon for like a hundred Zelika. This will take a lot and lot of new brand of people to come into the Zilliqa ecosystem, play the game, learn about the Zilliqa token, purchase the Zilliqa token, meaning that the price can go up very easily, or have, let's say, a 20 Zilliqa per game, uh, you know, fee. So for example, a couple of cents to play every game or anything like that. Of course, it's gonna be a play to earn free game, but either let's say you have a 100 Zilliqa a month membership, for so to say, and every game that you win, you win, for example, 10 Zelika. So, kind of like what Fortnite was or is still, you go and buy the Battle Pass. In the Battle Pass, you can earn enough currency, in-game currency, to go and pay for the next Battle Pass. So, this could be something like that and then have extra skins or, you know, lasers or colors for your character with purchasing the power of Zilliqa. So this could be something really, really interesting to go and see how they do it and how they will develop it. But the game itself is looking extraordinary well. This is yet on the beta version. So the team is playing, this is not out yet. When it's going to be launched to the people now, of course there, there are some things that needs to be fixed, whether also the graphic have to be fixed or it's gonna be launched, let's say in this cartoon-ish, to the version or you know then it's going to have a update a good big update for it to go and be able to become very much realistic and like modern warfare or so on so this is all up to them to go and see whether they want to do it i do like this style of gameplay i must say not super realistic so that you know you are in a game i do like it so i am a fan of what they are doing now then of course is entirely up to them and maybe there's gonna be some DAO for the game there's gonna be the possibility to go and vote if you are a member of the game the, the level up the possibility that you can have if you level up and what level you achieve but this game and this is why I do believe in the future whether it's 2023 or whether it's 2024 we will see Zilliqa to $1 in my opinion which is very likely and the whole Zilliqa ecosystem now there is a lot of other updates, for example, we're gonna go and see that Aliens World have partnered with Zilliqa, so that is a number one blockchain game, which we're gonna go and see in just a second, but there are a lot of possibilities for Zilliqa and the Zilliqa ecosystem, in my opinion, after looking at what, you know, this game is and this game is offering and the possibility are very much endless on the blockchain so whether you're gonna go and do this whether you want to go and do another type of video game is completely up to them or you can also go and develop it and then 
let the audience play on the Zelika ecosystem. That's also something that other people are doing. But for the game, this is about it. There's just a couple of seconds left, but it does look very, very nice in my opinion. Let me know your thoughts down below on this video. The other thing that I did want to go and talk to you is about the Aliens World Gamify Game NFT, whatever you want to call it. Now, here you can go and follow them online. They are a very, very big game as we're able to go and see here. And Zelika on their official Twitter, they have announced that there is this partnership. They also have partnership with other games such as Demons. There is, uh, you know, every day or every week there's a new partnership. This is the tweet for the Zelika shooter. Go and follow me on Twitter at Crypto with Lorenzo if you do want to know more. There also is the Metapolis which is going on and the Metapolis has their own as we're able to go and see here Twitter handle so go and follow them. This is it's looking like it's in a stall they have not yet released any updates or graphic update there is some interviews and that's about it with a green screen behind but I do want to go and see more in game in metaverse gameplay and you know the way that there is and so on forgive me for the noise outside if you made it until this point of the video I'm in Venice the boats are going outside my window on the canal but apart from that Zilica is on the right move now the Metapolis has to go and be a little bit Pushed in my opinion, that's what I think it should be. But at the end of the day, it's all up to them and what they believe. But of course, Zilica, with also you know the biggest project is XCAD over here. It is the biggest project in the Zilica ecosystem, in my opinion, and what has the possibility to go and do now. Also, they are taking it slow because they want to launch a project, a product that is fully functional. But when it does work, you know, we've seen reviews from the people that, for example, here that they have the plugin extension to go and earn by watching YouTube. If you don't know, you are able to go and earn. And with their YouTube channel, which they already have, if we go and click over here, we're able to go and see their official YouTube channel over here, which I'm not even subscribed, let me subscribe now. And by watching this with the XCAD plugin, you are also able to go and earn while watching YouTube. So they're launching and then they're testing it with their channel, which as of now, it looks like everybody is very happy with the results and everybody is saying that it works actually really, really smooth. For example, here, I've been telling the plugin for a few days, I've been testing and it's perfect hassle-free. So. It is looking good. They got also a nice partnership with Pralava, which is a traveling website. So the Zilica ecosystem, it is looking very, very healthy as of right now. It is looking with a lot of potential in my opinion. And we could see a lot of brand new features come into play in this Q, you know, Q3, Q2, whatever it is of 2022. But with that said, of course, let me know your thoughts down below, whether you like it, whether you don't like it, whether you're an investor or it's the first time that you hear about it. But with that said, thank you for watching guys and I see you all in tomorrow's video. Ciao, ciao.